Hey guys, welcome to your uh, general reading for Capricorn. This is going to be for your August 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, and Jupiter, Saturn. Actually, this could be in any replacements because anything could come up. Um, so we're going to take a look and see what's good that's coming in for you guys, okay, for August. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situations. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages where the collective um, Capricorn people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So tell me about Capricorn. What's good coming in for Capricorn for August 2024 for Capricorn for Capricorn here? What's coming in for Capricorn for August 2024? What's good coming in for Capricorn? So we have Water Dragon, helped you float easily round obstacles here. Christ's light and the love are flowing. Develop your psychic abilities and go with the flow. I mean, some of you guys could be overcoming obstacles and going with the flow here and developing your intuition and your psychic abilities at this time here or that you're learning to trust this more here because I feel like it's guiding you or that you feel like it's guiding you towards the right places at this time here, okay? We have blue dragon galactic, we have blue, dark blue galactic dragon. Helps you listen to your voice of the universe. Ignite the codes of your master blueprint. Access cosmic wisdom and enter higher services. So I feel like you guys could be entering higher services here where you're giving back to others and helping others here. I do feel like you guys are definitely hearing the voices of the universe here because I feel like you guys are getting a lot of downloads here and a lot of intuitive hits. And I feel like you guys are seeing a lot of synchronicities here and I feel like you guys are getting a lot of ringing in your ears here, okay? We also have golden orange dragon. Expand your light of ascension here. Be a peaceful warrior. Help those in need. Remember your magnificence here. So I do feel like you guys are going through some sort of spiritual ascension here. And as you go through your spiritual ascension here, I do feel like you guys are definitely guiding others and helping others and supporting others here too with knowledge and wisdom here, okay? So golden orange dragon. And also we have aquamarine dragon from Neptune. Enables you to access your deepest soul wisdom. Spirituality and wisdom are available to you. Develop your psychic abilities and receive ineffable soul knowledge here. So I feel like you guys definitely have a lot of knowledge and wisdom. You guys are definitely learning a lot about spirituality, your gifts here, okay? And I feel like you guys are stepping into your gifts, stepping into your higher purpose in life here. What else do we have here for Capricorn? What else does Capricorn need to know, look out for, work on? What else is coming in for Capricorn that's good for uh, August 2024 for Capricorn? So Capricorn, we have the sun and the star, wow. Yeah, I, I really feel like the universe is speaking to you guys at this time. Yeah, and I feel like you guys are definitely being called or that you guys are like stepping into your purpose in life here at this time. Yeah, I mean, you guys could also be stepping out of the matrix here, you know, doing some, basically stepping out of what is the social norm here. You know, what societal norms expects us to do here. You're stepping out of that. We have the chariot here, cancer energy, and also we have the five of wands here. I feel like you're seeing a way forward here for yourself, but I also feel like there's other people in and around you that's trying to stop you in your tracks here, okay? And I feel like one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like you're not allowing anyone to dictate how you live your life. And I feel like you're gonna live your life, but on your own terms here. 
basically trusting yourself and trusting your intuition, trusting the messages that you're receiving from the universe at this time here. All right. We have uh, the hangman, Piscean energy here and the death card. Wow. You're going through a huge transition in your life here. I feel like you felt like you were doing the right thing by following societal norms here, you know, and I feel like you guys are definitely breaking free from that because I feel like you guys are getting tired of that. So I feel like you guys are going through this transition and I feel like you guys are going through this huge spiritual transformation here. What the hangman? Piscean energy here and the death card, Scorpio energy. Tell me about the uh, sun card here. Why is the sun card here? The Sun card and the Ace of Wands. Yeah, you're de definitely finding your fire here, your passion, your inspiration here. And I feel like it's nothing that you expected here. Yeah, Three of Cups here and the Ten of Swords. So one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like these Ten of Swords are basically a representation of things that you were following that is not serving a higher purpose in your life here. I feel like also you guys are definitely creating your own soul tribe here too, or that you guys are meeting your soul tribe at this time here. That is encouraging you to step out of, you know, what is deemed as normal in society here. We have the Ten of Swords, Three of Cups, Ace of Wands here. We have Justice, Libra Energy here. Okay, some of you guys could be realizing that you guys are healers here, okay? You guys are healers. Uh, you know, sometimes that star card is a representation of a light worker's card. Now, if you guys are not stepping into that energy, you guys could be going stepping into an energy of being of service to others, helping out society, innovating for society here. Because so, that star card could also be a representation of someone here doing very sciencey stuff here. You know, the Eight of Wands and the Hangman, the Death card and the Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This is your energy right here. Momentum is really picking up through this change that you're experiencing here. And I feel like you are embracing it fully as if it was your best friend here. Okay. You know, because when it comes to change, you know, some Capricorns um, have a difficult time, you know, kind of going along with it. But I see you actually going along with it and really trusting it. And I feel like it has a lot to do with the spiritual path that you're on right now here at Capricorn. All right. We have... Three of Pentacles, yeah. I do feel like you guys are definitely meeting your soul tribe at this time. Yeah, I do feel like with the Hierophant here, you guys are definitely, you know, learning higher knowledge here and wisdom here and sort of like passing that down to other people. Yeah, you know? So I do feel like, you know, when it comes to the universe speaking to you, I feel like you guys, like I said, you guys are getting a lot of downloads and a lot of intuitive hits. And I feel like you guys are definitely passing that along to other people here because i do feel like people do turn to you for advice here okay people do feel comfortable and safe talking to you here perhaps you, you've always been like that uh capricorn so i feel like um you know signs from the universe has been guiding you and leading you towards this point in your life so capricorn i hope that this was helpful i hope that this resonated if it did leave a comment down in the comment section below like this video share this video subscribe Hit the notification bell and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.